Lexi and today I am very excited to be filming my very requested BeautyCon haul slash what I got at BeautyCon Dallas 2016. I did a vlog over on my vlog channel and a ton of you guys commented that you wanted to see all of it so yeah that's what I'm doing and by the way I vlogged the whole BeautyCon trip and I thought it was pretty fun so feel free to go check out that vlog if you want and also a lot of you guys may or may not have noticed I got braces finally and I did a vlog all about that on my vlog channel so if you want to know more about that also just head on over to my vlog channel so yeah anyways this year beautycon actually invited me to the event and i was so excited about it they gave out an insane amount of free stuff and i'm not trying to brag in any way and also i'm probably gonna keep some of it of course but i think a lot of it i may give away to you guys so if you see anything in particular in this video that you wouldn't mind having feel free to let me know down below for a possible future giveaway i'm just going to go ahead and jump into it so this video isn't like 30 minutes long i don't think i'm going to be going in any specific order i'm just kind of going through everything so yeah, the first thing that I got is this little gift bag from Hollywood Beauty Secrets and I actually love this brand before. They have like the sticky tape for clothes that I love. So in here we got some fashion tape, some, let's see, uh, oil blotting sheets, definitely need those, and then some silicone cover-ups. The next thing is this eyeshadow palette, I think eyeshadow, and I was really excited to see they had it there. It's the Lime Crime Venus palette and it has really pretty kind of like reddish toned colors in it, I don't exactly remember. I got two of these Tarte mascaras, it's called the Tartist, and I have never heard of it. I think it's a new product, so I will try it out. I'm always on the lookout for new mascaras. I got this Maybelline Master Contour Kit, and I really need this because I am so clueless when it comes to contouring. Like seriously, I have no idea how to do it and not look crazy. There's actually like a little how-to thing on the back of this, which is pretty helpful. I actually got three bottles of one conditioner. This one is in Spring Honey Lilac, this one is Spring Orange Blush, Awesome. And this one is Spring Gardenia Green Tea. I think I'm saying that right. Completely bare. Okay. I've never heard of this brand before, but it's completely bare. And I got their moisturizing no bump shave gel. Because sometimes after I shave my legs, I'll get like these annoying little bumps on it. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. But I'm going to start using this and seeing if it makes any difference. Connor was actually giving away these t-shirts, so I thought, why not get one? And it's pretty soft, so yeah, that's just what it says. NYX was there, and they actually gave away this full um, pouch full of makeup. And it's a really cute makeup bag also. It's kind of like a black snakeskin pattern, and I'm not going to go through everything that's in it, but I'll kind of just give you guys like a peek, like... I don't know, you can see there's like a lot. We've got a blush, we've got butter lipsticks, we've got some like color correctors, all sorts of stuff in here. You can kind of just like take a look for yourself somewhat. Things are about to fall out. I got this Love Always kind of gift thing and it just has a pair of pearl infinity earrings. I'm pretty excited to try this. It's the Garnier Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Water and I've never tried anything like this before so maybe it'll replace my usual makeup remover wipe. Beauticon Control, I have not heard of them before but this is actually like a light up lip gloss. There's a little light in it so you can see exactly where you're applying it which I thought was kind of cool and unique. I got two little Burt's Bees lip balms from Shea Moisture. I got their Superfruit Complex Hand and Body Scrub and then I also got this Fruit Fusion Coconut Water Weightless Styling Mousse so yeah, I got these two. I've only tried their body lotion, but I actually really like it. Maybelline had a whole bunch of these little matte liquid lipsticks, and you were allowed to take like as much as you want, so I got one in a nude color, a bright purple color, I don't know where I'll wear this, um, a very dark kind of like plum wine-like color, a bright pink color, and then a sort of corally red color. I also got these two Maybelline mascaras. It's the Lash Sensational. I have not tried this one before. More oil blotting sheets. Great when you're an oil spill like me. This Natural Coconut Shea Leave-In Condition and this Red Ken hairspray. This is like a really big full-size bottle. This Red Ken pillow proof blow dry primer. I don't exactly know how it's pillow proof, but who knows? Maybe it is. I got this Wen Spring Honey Lilac perfume, and I did not actually know that Wen made perfume, but I will give it a try. I got this Pop Sockets little phone accessory, even though I don't know what it does. This Maybelline Skinny Precise Eyeliner. Hair ties, which is always a good essential to have. This little $10 gift card to Blinks. I don't know what that is. I actually have heard of this brand before, and it's the Benzac Acne Solution. I just picked up this complete acne solution regimen, which I probably need because you probably already noticed my skin is breaking out 
a lot right now, so yeah, that's fun. More oil blotting sheets. And then this little QVC gift bag, and I'll just kind of go through quickly what's in here. We have a smartphone ring, more cute little hair ties, purity facial cleanser, and I know my mom loves this stuff, so I'll probably give it to her. A little skin exfoliant, dragon fruit sorbet, I really like that name, and it's a lip crayon. Eyeshadow stick, I think it's like a dark purple color. A travel size of the It Cosmetics CC Cream. And then this Conjac sponge by Julep, and it's actually like wet, so that's kind of cool. Two more full-size one bottles, I'm kind of like set for life. I just realized I got another Lime Crime Venus palette, another Maybelline Contour palette, Another one of these Hollywood secrets like little gift set a pack of their fashion tape that actually like rolls out And then I got three more of the vivid matte liquid lipsticks and these are the colors I don't know if I got these ones already not sure but you can see them I got some little not your mother's like shampoo and conditioner samples as well as this little Customized hair tie that I thought was cute. This is what Ardell Beauty was giving out and I have heard of them before It's basically chock full of just all kinds of eyelashes And I think there's also an eyeliner in there and there's like a little brow kit in the back I think you can see see that hopefully but I don't really wear fake lashes so I will probably give this away to you guys they're really pretty though I got this red Ken set of hair products there is a dry finishing spray I think a dry shampoo and another one of their like pillow proof sprays I got this PYT argan oil super serum I don't even know what's in here I got so many like hair product samples I got this perfume mania like travel perfume thing I forgot which one I got I think it might have been the Jessica Simpson perfume but you can just like throw it in your bag on the go and I think it's really cute I got this thing and I'm not completely sure what it is it just came in this little white box but I'm gonna open it for you guys it says the cut life on it and then let's see pull this out it's a comb and a mirror for on the go I'm gonna put this in my purse or backpack and then I got this Eva Ava I don't know NYC little bag it's mesh on the back and then in here we have a freshen it up dry shampoo a clean it up shampoo and then the soften it up conditioner. So this little black kind of takeout style box is from China Glaze. And in here is a bunch of bright kind of summer colored nail polishes. So I thought I would open it with you guys. So here's a little card. And in here there's actually two smaller boxes that I need to open. We have a bright orange one. Bubblegum pink color. This kind of yellow limeish color. A dark purple. A very good for Halloween orange. A really pretty kind of reddish coral. Another kind of corally pinkish color. A very hot pink color. Sparkly purple. I think it's gold in there. I think this is my favorite one it's a light lavender one this teal kind of aquamarine one and this really bright green color I'm very excited for these and I think the colors are perfect for summer and there was another nail polish brand that was giving this out and I don't exactly remember what it is I think it's a special kind of nail polish so this is like the first level it's this um, sechi base coat and colorful set I think oh my gosh there's two rows of nail polish there's like a base and then you have lacquer colors and then there's a top ceiling coat and there's more underneath and I think that this is so pretty and I love the color choices. I think that's everything from the actual BeautyCon day, but there was a BeautyCon kind of kickoff pre-party and I went to that and they handed out little gift bags, so I thought I would quickly go through what I got there. From this Makeup Plus stand, I think it's like an app you can edit makeup on yourself with. They were handing out these Revolution palettes. Mine is the Redemption Eyeshadow Palette Iconic One and my mom got like the party colorful palette, but I'm glad I got this more natural one. This EOS lip balm and they actually wrapped it up to put their brand and BeautyCon Dallas on it and my mom was especially excited about the Kiehl's stuff it's like a skincare brand so this is an ultra facial cream a skin plumping serum a special like dermatologist style peel a lip balm for very dry lips and my lips do get very dry at times and then this creamy under eye treatment with avocado in it and I really want to try this I think it's my favorite thing from this gift bag I just realized I didn't even show you guys what the gift bags looked like so there's that one I just showed you Here's the main kind of like hair one. It just has this life is too short for boring hair quote. My hair is really boring. I should probably start following them. These are really heavy, but these are the actual like beauty gone style bags. Kind of messed up QVC bag. Also, isn't this cute? This is a little photo booth picture. So that is it for this What I Got at BeautyCon Dallas 2016. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really want to go to BeautyCon LA this summer, but it's literally like a day after my aunt's wedding, which I don't know why the timing always doesn't work out, but I'm hoping I might still be able to go. I don't know. You guys can let me know if you're going to be there, and hopefully I'll be there. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you have any other video requests that you'd like to see me do, feel free to let me know down below. And of course, go check out my vlog channel subscribe if you enjoyed all that stuff I don't even have to say it I get so annoying but yeah okay bye guys I can't say